In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a rounded bar chart like this in Power BI with minimal effort. So let's start the video. Let's take this bar chart and in the Y axis, I will add the product column and in the X axis, we are going to add the sales column. It is showing us the sales chart, which is having the rectangular bars. Now, to make this bar look rounded, we'll use the error bars. So let's open the format pane and let's go to the error bars. And here in the error bars, we are applying the settings to the sales, which is the only measure that we have here. And let's come to this options. Here we have this type as by field and we have this upper bound and lower bound. So for the lower bound, we'll have to create one measure called zero so that the bar should start from zero. So let's create one measure and uh, let's call this as zero and this will just be a zero value. Now let's use this zero measure in this lower bound. Why? Because we want this error bar to start from the zero and in the upper bound, let's choose the sales measure that we are using in this chart. Now, if I enable this, you'll see we have created the error bars on each bar. Next, basically, we don't want the bars. We will just work with the error bars. For that, let's go to the bar section and let's make this color as transparent. So make this as 100%. Now we are just left with the error bars. So let's go to the error bars. So here, this options thing is done. Next, go to the bar. So here we are going to do some formatting. So for that, let's choose the bar color. Here we can choose this uh, green color as a bar color. And here the maximum width that we can make is 10. So once we give this as 10 and in the markers, let's choose this fill circle. Now you can see this marker is separated from the bar. For that, we can turn off this border size as zero. So we can create a rounded bar like this. And we have this tooltip so we can turn off the tooltip from here. So now if you see, it's showing this sales value. Now, if you want to make this bar a little wider, we don't have an option to make this more because values must be less than or equal to 10. So for that thing, we'll have to do it as 10. And this is the maximum we can do. Now, if you want to increase the width of the bar, there is an option to do that. What we can do is we can choose the border color same as the bar color. So let's choose this green color as the border color. Now we'll increase the border size. The maximum border size we can do is two pixels. If we choose three here, this cannot be done. So let's choose this as two. And now accordingly, we'll have to adjust this marker as well. So let's increase the size here as well. So if I increase this to seven, now it's look perfect. So we'll have to align this markers and bars according to the size of the bars. And this is how we create a rounded bar chart in Power BI with minimal efforts. If you want to connect with me and book a one-to-one -one call on any Power BI issue, you can book a call on TopMate. Also, if you want to buy Power BI reports along with the data set and BRD documents, all of these links are provided in the description. So see you there. These are the books that I highly recommend buying that can take your Power BI skills to the next level. These three books can cover almost all the aspects of Power BI from DAX to Power Query to the overall Power BI dashboarding. You can find the link of these books in the description. Check them out if you want to level up faster. So let me know if you have learned something from this video. I hope you like this video and if you like my videos, do not forget to subscribe my channel. Till then, goodbye and thanks for watching.